Okay, sorry about that, sorry about the slowdown, but my PC was completely running out of disk space. So I kind of had to stop recording and convert some videos. Did turn out though that that was a blessing in disguise because as some of you I'm sure will have noticed in a previous video. Search for more information about the hag who attacked you. That is not completed. Now I do know where to get that information. I missed it last time. But I have obtained the information. And now I'm going to get it. From the nursery. I have to go to the nursery. Oh god. Right, that's right. I remember where I am. <laughs> now we'll just run past you and you won't hit me. Ow, oh, you hit me. Okay. Hey, let's do this in a kind of speed run botch kind of way. Why not? God, my stats are going to suck for this mission. Run, 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 Now there should be around here, and then... Hello! Do you think he saw me? I think he might have. We have to go... Yeah, this. This thing that I missed before. We've got to read this. Type of incident, death. Patient staff members involved, Laurel S. Orphan. <laughs> Is that a name? Laurel S. Orphan. Right, that makes more sense. Uh, witnesses, informants. H. Drept. Orphan description of incident. Orphan. Alright, description of incident. That's difficult to separate. Two orphans were playing in the attic in the asylum area when one of the patients must have killed the girl. A large amount of blood marks in the, uh, marks the scene of the incident, but no body has been found. A search is underway. The girl's playmate, Drept, insists the killer was some sort of hag, a grey lady, not a patient. However, since he is just a child, and without other witnesses or cabbages, evidence to back up his story, we can only conclude that one of the patients killed the girl, then hid the body. Conclusions. We must uh, enforce the no, the no orphans near the white ward patient rule. We are lucky the girl has no family to make a fuss. <laughs> there we go. Found the information. I was playing hide and seek with my friend Drat, but he never found me. Instead, the grey lady found me. I tried to run, but the door was locked, and I couldn't get it open. Hurrah! Now we can leave. I think we've caused a bit of a ruckus here, haven't we? I think so. Yeah, I can't wait to read the statistics for this mission. Found, what do you reckon? 16, 17 times, maybe? Times discovered, 127. Very impressive. Now it's letting me out, which is nice. Um, now I need to find a window. I need to find a window. Hi. I need to find a big window. I need to... F oh, God. Oh, 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 oh. Ha ha! I foiled you! Yes! Never mind, eh? Hello? How are you supposed to get out of there? Oh, this goes a long way up. Why would you build it this big? I don't remember the building being this big from the outside. That makes no sense. Unless they had a gigantic tower that has since fallen down, which is possible, I suppose. Oh, isn't that weird? Alright, stealth. Let's try and do this very last bit properly. What is this place? See, there's plenty of guys there. Oh, and there's the window I need. Right there. Oh, well, screw doing it properly. Run! Wee! Um, wee! 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 Oh, crap. I finally managed to escape from that place, but I think I'm out of my depth here. I saw an old portrait of a girl who looks just like that keeper translator. How can that be? I only found traces of the hag. I don't think she's been there since Drep saw her all those years ago. So I'm left with questions. 
and the vial of blood the ghost had me steal. The ghost is beckoning. I think I'd better follow. This isn't over yet. Statistics. Uh, times caught only nine. Well, that took me quite a while. It was a big level, relatively speaking. Uh, I didn't get all that much loot, but then loot doesn't really matter that much since I think I only have one mission left and I've got, what, 7,000 gold now? Well, 8,000 now. So I'd, I, I did use a lot of equipment there, but I can just stock up and uh, I'll be fine. Okay, so no opponents blackjack, no opponents killed. Really? I thought I killed some thingies. Oh well. Uh, yeah, I, I picked a lot of locks. I, I took a lot of damage and I <laughs> healed it all up. Alright. Onwards. Okay, I gotta follow the ghost. We made it out of the cradle. Hooray! You follow me. Okay. I'll take you to the place she buried me. Ah. I'll bring my blood with you. Uh, have I got your blood? I hope so. Can these guys see the um ghost? I'll have to assume not, since he's just walking away from it. right there. She's right there. Um. The ghost. The ghost's right there. I guess you guys can't see the ghost. Why isn't the ghost moving? Maybe I have to move away and then move back to her it will trigger her again you still have my blood right yes you need it to remove the marks has he seen me well move then that was a bit weird because I have to stay really close to her oh I think they can see the ghost uh, yes they can Come on, I can't go away. I'll just have a quick I better go find Laurel. Yeah, she's there. You aren't getting up on me, are you? No. Please help me. Please follow me. I am following you. Right on my heels. You're you're causing a bit of a bit of a ruckus here, Laurel. Slight bit of a ruckus here on the streets with the ghost and all. Where are we going? Oh great, to the Hammerite place. Fantastic. Yeah, zombies. Hooray. I want that. Oh god. Run away? That's not very hammerite is it? Oh, a ghost! Run away! Hang on, aren't you supposed to do stuff about this kind of thing? Isn't that what you do? 